Michigan, Jane Doe asks, how do I calculate the correct dose to give my child by body weight? Okay, so this is a question of dose calibration. Um, so I've got to start off with my, I'm not a doctor, this isn't medical advice, but um, in terms of the, the, the part of it that's a simple math question, most medication, especially medications being administered to children, is, is done according to the body weight of the child. And the, the thinking behind that is that a 50 pound child would need half as much of a given medication as a 100 pound child. And that's, that makes logical sense in terms of your body's metabolism and its ability to take in a substance and process it. So, you know, there, there's sound logic to that. And I certainly don't want to suggest that I know how much uh, is an appropriate dose for a child because that's a very controversial thing. You should talk to other parents with special needs children. Ideally, if you have a doctor who's willing to have an intelligent conversation on the subject, talk to them about it. But hypothetically, for instance, if you wanted to wean your child on to CBD and you know start with a low dose and move up, say a 0.5 milligram per pound of body weight, if you've got a 40 pound child, you're literally times in 40 by 0.5 and that's 20 milligrams. If, you're, if you then want to double that dose and move it up to one milligram per pound, that's just one times 40, the, you know, the milligrams per pound times the body weight of the child, so one times 40 is 40 milligrams. If you then go to you know, two milligrams per pound, again, it's the number of milligrams per pound times the number of pounds, so two times 40, that's an 80 milligram dose. So, that, you know, it's a very simple algorithm once you understand the concept behind it. You're, you're simply taking the body weight of the child and timesing it by the number of desired milligrams per pound. And that's the pound per milligram, that's the milligram per pound of body weight.